What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name of course is Multi Kills HD, and uh, today in this gameplay I think you guys are really going to enjoy it because I actually lost this gameplay, and I just recently found it again, and in this gameplay I'm sitting in this game with Cherry Seaweed, my cousin, and me, and we make a huge comeback in this game from the score, you know, we, we pretty much came into the game and thought it was a pretty much instant loss, but unfortunately, fortunately actually, we somehow made a comeback and won the game. And it was really, really close to the end. So you guys might want to watch the gameplay this time. Uh, it is actually something interesting that is in the gameplay, surprisingly enough. But anyways, what I'm going to talk about today is YouTube's new feature that is coming to YouTube in a month or two. And the new feature that is coming to YouTube is paid YouTube subscriptions. Now, this is what it is currently on YouTube. You know, if you go to somebody's channel and you like their content, you hit subscribe, you know. Once you hit that subscribe button, your videos from their channel are posted in your sub box. So you can see their channel's new videos when they come up. Alright, so that's what it is currently. YouTube has decided, you know, it would be kind of cool to say, you know, PewDiePie's videos or anybody's channel that you go to on a daily basis and watch your content, that the person that was producing the videos is able to do one of the two things. A, they are able to leave it how it remains right now, or they are able to change it to this way. They're able to now charge people to watch their videos for a certain amount of time. So let's say you want to watch Keemstar's videos, right? He has his new channel back. Uh, you know, that's all great. You guys want to watch all of his videos, for example. Keemstar now would be able to change it. So you could pay Keemstar, let's say, a dollar for a month access to Keemstar's videos. Just like his Bad Kid podcast that he has, you know, if you guys wanted to watch his podcast, which is hours, 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 and hours of content, you know, just able to listen to it while you're gaming or whatever the case is, you know, something along those lines, you know, he could automatically change the feature of a free subscription, which it currently stands, to maybe a dollar for permanent access to watch the Bad Kid podcast or the Bad Kid show, whatever you guys want to call it, you know. It's one of those things that you don't really know the name because they've been through so many names, but it's still the same thing. So, you know, that's going to be a really cool feature. Now, so this leads me to a question I want to be asking my viewers and, you know, other people around YouTube. Is how is YouTube users going to react to this update? Because, you know, A, it is going to allow, you know, people that would normally take it to iTunes, for example... To have to go through all that work, you know, transfer it to iTunes and then charge you, or you could just watch it on YouTube, you know, have a little bit of a video feature added on it, and you would be able to watch it this way instead of, you know, going through a different site like Amazon, downloading it and all those. But I can also see that there's going to be another problem. You know, some of these commentators are going to be hated on for charging people to watch their content. And, you know, I see both sides and I agree with both sides, you know. I don't see the point in not charging people if you're spending, you know, hundreds and hundreds of hours to produce content. But I also, at the same time, you know, YouTube isn't really a place to hopefully make six-figure incomes off of charging people for membership to watch your videos. You know, I disagree with that, but I also agree, you know, it would be worthwhile for people that do podcasts to charge maybe a dollar for a lifetime fee. You know, in that case, I could probably see that understanding because, you know, a dollar isn't that much. And, you know, I, I think it's good for both ends on that part. But people are probably going to go crazy with this and charge 15 to 20 bucks for uh, a week membership to watch some people's content, which is, I already know ahead of time is just wrong. You know, I don't think I'll personally charge people, but I'm really interested to hear in what your guys' feedback is on this, go ahead and leave a comment saying would you pay for somebody's or would you not. Anyways guys, my name of course is Multi Kills HD. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'm out. Peace.